My name's Jamie Keddy, and I'm from Scotland, but I live in Barcelona, in Catalonia, Spain. I'm a freelancer, um, but I've written for Oxford University Press and also do some work as a freelancer for the British Council. I'm going to be looking at the potential for making use of the video recording devices that students bring into the classroom on a daily basis. I'm talking about the ones on their mobile phones. So we're going to be looking at reasons for and ways to harness the potential of these very powerful devices. It's a skill that's expected from so many professionals these days, being able to speak to a camera. Um, it used to be only for actors and presenters, um, but now it can be for educators or teachers, writers, journalists. But there's more to it than that. I think if you're a language teacher, specifically if you're an English teacher working with young people, you're in a very um, special position, a unique situation. Because what you're doing is you're working to equip the young people in your country with the international medium for communication, the language of English. And by creating their own videos and by introducing themselves to the world and through sharing their stories, if you're prepared to go a little bit further and put them onto a video sharing site like YouTube, we can meet the young people from your country. And when young people speak, their voices cut through all the rest. Now this is important in a world when um, the general public seem to make their opinions from what they see or read in the media. One problem that I often hear from teachers is that they feel they don't have the competencies or the technological skills to make use of video cameras, video editors, video sharing sites. Now this is not a problem because you can show students what is expected of them, but you don't have to worry about how they're going to do it. If students need to know how to do it, they know how to find out through their friends or getting online and using tutorials.